I've noticed that quite a number of elite athletes are attracted to my Hypnobirthing Australia classes. In the past six months alone, I have taught Olympic cycling gold medalist Sarah Carrigan and her husband Steve-O, four times Olympic gold medal winner Libby Trickett and her husband Luke, and also other famous rugby league players, coaches, racing car drivers, all types of elite sports people. And it just got me thinking, what is it that is attracting high level athletes to the Hypnobirthing Australia Childbirth Education course? I'm Melissa Spilstead, Director of Hypnobirthing Australia. And in this video, I interviewed gold medalist Sarah Carrigan and her husband Steve-O to find out what they thought of the course. So tell me, what drew you to hypnobirthing in the first place? For me, throughout my life, especially as a sports person, I know how important the mind is, positive thoughts, positive thinking, and our mindset is in anything we undertake in life. So for me, birthing being one of the most important things in life, it just seemed like a no-brainer and it really has been what you've taught us so far is I'm really looking forward to giving birth. I was a little bit apprehensive and scared, I was fearful before having started our course last week but now I'm feeling much more at ease and yeah, looking forward to seeing the baby. And have you already been able to incorporate any of these techniques into your everyday life? I think some of them we probably already do. Uh, incorporate in everyday lives, um, especially in the context of uh, sport. Um, and we both teach people ride bikes, and um, the relaxation techniques are some things we use to help people do that to overcome their fears um, and their anxiousness when they doing that activity. And then when they can overcome that, they feel like they can do anything. So in the context of birth, it really is such a no-brainer and everybody should have access to this sort of course so that they can have such a great experience bringing their little one into the world. And they did indeed welcome their little one into the world in a very positive way. Here is a photo of Sarah, myself and other members of that particular hypnobirthing class when we all got together to swap positive birth stories and meet all the beautiful, calm little hypnobobs. Childbirth is considered by many to be one of the most, if not the most, challenging and intense events in our lives, both physically and mentally. And elite athletes recognize the importance of physical and mental preparation for a major event. So it's really not surprising that they are attracted to the Hypnobirthing Australia course. In our course, we cover how to create and maintain a positive mindset, knowledge about the birth process, tools to cope with the intensity of labor and enable our body to work at peak performance. And we know that our support team is also a very important component to our success. So our partner and caregivers play key roles in hypnobirthing too. And the great thing is you don't need to be an elite athlete to reap the benefits of hypnobirthing. You just need to have the desire for a calm and positive birth experience. So, I'm Melissa Spilstead, and if you watch this video anywhere other than on our website, then please head over to our website, hypnobirthingaustralia.com.au. We have online resources, parent classes, private classes, our Hypnobubs online course, we have practice bundles, practitioner training, lots of things available. And if you haven't already, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page so that you can keep up to date and inspired for your positive birth. If you scroll down 
then I would love to hear your comments and a click on that like button. We all love to be liked. <laughs> so please tell me in your comments, have you used hypnobirthing yourself or have you maybe supported someone who has used hypnobirthing? Have you ever compared birth to preparing for an athletic event? I'd love to hear your thoughts. So please keep in touch and keep spreading the word of positive birthing.